Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is very different from my usual content as you can see from the title or the title down there, I never know where it is. Um, today I'm doing a football related video but with a fashion twist to it. Football as in soccer if you're from the United States. So if you're curious to see what football and fashion is all about, keep on watching. So hi everyone, I hope you're doing all very well. If you're from Europe, you probably know why I'm posting this today. Basically at the moment, the Euros are happening in Europe. It's a big tournament of all the national teams that has passed obviously a pre-selection. Um, there are basically, I was gonna say fighting, but they're playing against each other in this big tournament. We are exactly in the middle of the Euros, which means two weeks already passed and we still have two weeks left. This is like the next very interesting two weeks because you know, there was already a selection now, there were a lot of games that were played and a lot of teams obviously are not in the tournament anymore. However, Switzerland is still in the tournament, yay! So I'm so excited, as you guys know, I am from Switzerland. So everybody in Europe is really like watching a lot of football at the moment, which I love. If you guys might not know, you probably don't know, I've never talked about it on my channel, but I used to be a huge fan of football. I really wanted to actually become a football journalist on TV at some point. And then I kind of lost interest and got into fashion a bit and now I'm a little bit back into it especially with the euros i've been back into loving football and everything related to that world so i'm very excited by the way it's men's football i'm talking about today and not women's football just if you're interested to know that and i was thinking recently like a few days ago why don't i film a video on how to make a football jersey cute because i personally own four different football jerseys i own switzerland obviously the german one the spanish one and the french one i own these four because obviously they're my favorite teams and some of them are actually really old because as I told you I used to be a huge football fan so some of these shirts are not even you know available anymore and they're definitely not the ones that the actual players wear anymore but that's besides the point because you get the idea the idea is to know how to style or learn how to style in a cute way a football jersey because if maybe your brother your husband your boyfriend your dad whoever watches football and wants you to come with them at the pub or at the bar or invites you to the stadium to watch the game or a fan zone whatever it is and that you own a jersey or want to wear a jersey it's nice to make it look good you know because it's really a piece of clothing that is not easy to style or to make it just look fashionable so these looks are not overly fashionable i didn't go too crazy with the styling and the accessories and all that but I think I created four kind of cute outfits. At least it's something I would wear if I would go to a bar to watch the game or even to the stadium if I would have been lucky enough to get a ticket. So this is obviously something you could do with other sports that also have jerseys kind of similar to the football ones, but this is really focused on football. What we're gonna do is go through the different little outfits I created and uh, I'll just tell you how I styled everything and all that good stuff. Uh, keep in mind that obviously today is a video on a Saturday. It's a bit different from usual but don't worry next week you will have the usual video on Thursday it's just that whenever I feel like filming an extra video I do it and I hope you don't mind it too much so the very first outfit is gonna be the Swiss one so just to show you this is my little Swiss jersey that I have right here I decided to style it with a lot of white so basically I went with my favorite little white pants that I wear a lot in spring summer I've talked about them so many times on my channel I'm wearing my new Gucci belt if you haven't seen the video I will link it around the screen I did a review of of my new Gucci belt and I decided to go also with this cute little bag that I love so 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 much I thought it looked so good with the different colors of the outfit and also obviously my shoes which these ones are definitely um, just random shoes like nothing special there's like random flats once again you can totally go with any type of shoe for the outfits I'm gonna show I just wanted to wear shoes to show what I would wear me usually and I feel like flats are a very practical shoe so I went with flats for that and Afterwards, I also added this little tweed jacket from Mango because I wanted to add a little something if it's a little, you know, chilly outside if you're outside or to make it a little bit more formal looking or just more elegant in general. I tucked the shirt inside the pants because I find it much more flattering, especially if you have a really nice belt that you can show off a little bit. So that's what I did with a lot of the jerseys you will see in the video. It's just much more flattering than when you put it on top of the pants like normal. I would also go with my little shorts. I have like 
like similar shorts in white to the pants. Um, so I would totally do that same look, but with shorts if it was really hot outside. So this is the very first look. I think it's very elegant, cute, and obviously for Switzerland, we need to keep the white that is very important as well in the whole outfit. Then we go with Germany, and this is the shirt I own. It's black and white, very Chanel vibes. Um, I think the look I created is also a little bit like schoolgirl vibe because the little skirts that I'm wearing, I've talked about them many times on my channel and notably in my vlog in Milan from like last week. Basically, I feel like this tucked in the little skirts looks so cute, so feminine. It's perfect if it's very hot outside. The fact that it skirts is really lovely because it's skirt, which makes it feminine, but at the same time you have the shorts underneath, which protects you from anything, from the wind or anything. I decided to go for my castanio wedges, which I unboxed on my channel as well. I will also link it around the screen. I thought the castanio were really cute with that outfit because when you wear something short, it's nice to have a bit of elevation and the castanios are not too high, which is lovely. Also, if you're going even to the stadium, they're so comfortable, I would absolutely recommend those if you're searching for cute shoes but that look very feminine and also the little bag I think it matches perfectly well it's super elegant together it's a very elegant but flirty outfit and I thought that this with the colors like it's just such a nice mix with the colors of the German uh, jersey so I also tucked it in to the little skirt this is a little bit less fitted than the Swiss one that I have the Swiss one is the jersey that is the most fitted of all but tucked in the little skirts I think it looks super flattering Oh, next one is so funny because it's a very cool one. It's uh, with the French one that I have right here. This one is not flattering at all. I think it's a size too big. This one is definitely not a fitted one. This one is actually quite large, a bit too large for me. So I decided to have it tucked in my jeans with, again, the Gucci belt. Jeans, I think, are so cool and comfortable when you go watch a game. It's the perfect pair of pants, I think, to wear. Um, also, you can sit on anything without getting dirty or anything like that because I feel like jeans, you can't really see that much. Um, not like, you know, the pants I showed before that are all white. And I tucked this in. I also wear my little glasses and also the little bag that I think um, match very well. I mean, it's not really a little bag, but I wanted to go for that cool vibe. Like you're carrying a lot of things and you have your glasses, you have your like brands and things like that. That I was really inspired by that for that particular uh, jersey outfit. And basically I have my really big glasses, which are Gucci as well. And I got them recently. I have an unboxing review actually coming up very soon on my channel. So stay tuned. Tune. They're a pretty recent purchase as well. And I decided to go with my little H&M like Bottega Veneta dupes. I thought it looked very nice with the jeans, but honestly in real life, like in person, I'd probably go for sneakers or for the castanier wedges because it's a little bit more comfortable than these little shoes. But that's personal, obviously. And I thought I would show you something that looked good together. Um, so yeah, that one I really like it because it's such a cool vibe one. And as I said, I totally picture myself wearing jeans with a jersey tucked in and the colors match really well so if you have a jersey this color try with jeans because it could look really really good so that's the third outfit for france and finally the last outfit is with spain right here this is a really old jersey i believe um so this one is also very oversized it was really hard to find a way to style it but i went for a very fun and young look i decided to pair this uh, jersey with my mini shorts so there's two ways to wear them the first one i tucked in just the front of the shirt because I thought it looked very cool and laid back. The other one is to put it on top and since it's pretty long, I know that it's really fashionable to kind of cover your mini shorts or just leave the bottom of them. Like mine, for example, a little bit like torn at the bottom, which a lot of mini shorts have that nowadays. And I love the look that you just see the end of the mini shorts. It's really cute. And I paired it with my cute little um, Adidas like white simple sneakers, which are the ones I would see myself wear the most when I go to watch a game. It's so like chill and laid back. I would definitely see myself wearing that. So I thought the whole look looked very sporty and my hair, I really like what I did there. I never do that usually, but it was just the whole vibe of a very like Spanish vibe. I think a Spanish girl would wear this. I'm not sure. She'd probably be much more tan than me and it would look much better, but I thought that looked just cute anyways. And I also went with a very simple pochette as a bag. Um, um, not I wouldn't say go for a pochette go for like also maybe for example a backpack could look really cute like a mini backpack but I loved going for the pochette to create a bit of a more elegant mature look at the same time I don't know I really like the idea of mixing things like that together this one is also a quite different vibe <laughs> to the two or three others I feel like all of them have different like vibes to them and 
I really loved styling this with my mini shorts, jean mini shorts. So yeah, so that's pretty much it for my outfits with all of the jerseys that I own. So the four that I own. I didn't really want to do something too long as I said because this is just a random video on a Saturday and I didn't want to take your time if you're not a fan of football or anything like that. But my goal was also to show you four different styles. Like I feel like one is a bit more fun and flirty, one is very young and sporty, one is a bit more formal, one is cool. Like I really wanted to show different styles and it's really something I would picture myself wearing if I go to a football game which I also wanted to do something very real for you guys so yeah so that's pretty much it um, I don't have anything else to add as I told you the usual Thursday video will be up on my channel next week at 9 p.m. it's gonna be probably a review so stay tuned and if you're not subscribed yet subscribe it's free it's the red button below and it means a lot to me as usual and if you watch the euros I wish you all a great euro have fun and I hope your team wins or I hope not depends if you're for Switzerland as well and as I always say I will see you next week in my next video bye everyone and enjoy the Euros